Okay, this is um, Patrick Locke here. I made a video um, before about the Saturn view and the fact that the uh, gear lever just broke. Just something snapped real close to where you do the stick shift. Um, here's the car. And, um, and down here um, are the parts that were exchanged. Uh, here is the bill and um, see if I can just get it where you can see that um, it's not even reached 70,000 miles and um, it cost 475 those two cables that you see down there on the floor cost uh, 190 dollars and 85 cents and then that little piece of plastic you see down there I believe was like 45 dollars apparently something like that anyway um, the whole thing came to 475. Now, um, you know, I remember we could have probably bought a car uh, for that, but this point I wanted to make are oh, this. First of all, um, one of these cables runs from the um, gear lever inside your car and runs to the um, transverse engine gearbox and supposedly I was told that the lighter cable works the reverse gear and the uh, darker cable works the others. I can't guarantee that that is correct because it was in fact the reverse gear that used to cause all the trouble. But um, it's kind of interesting to see what we actually have here. This cable slides in and out quite easily and you can sort of see at the other end there that it's sliding in and out nicely. And the other cable just is absolutely stuck absolutely not moving at all and because I was trying to change gear and it was resistant something to do with this thing snapped and my two questions really are first of all this isn't a component that's worn out this is a component that's defective and the other thing is if this other cable is working so nicely, and it surely is, as you can see, no problem with that. But in that case, why did I have to buy two of them uh, at a cost of $190? I can't see that, actually that there's $190 worth there, but if that is $190 worth, $190 worth then you know it asked ought to last more than 60,000 miles so here's my question really what GM do you think about that and what do you Saturn view owners think about um, having that kind of thing go wrong and uh, is it a uh, deficiency? Is it a component uh, that is inefficient, wrongly manufactured or badly manufactured? I'll be interested in your comments. Bye.